hello everyone welcome to my channel cat tutorials for beginners and in this tutorial we will create a model of a screw so uh, we are going to create just a simple screw so with a threads so let us start with the solidworks new part so uh, now this modeling environment is displayed here so let us go to the sketch we'll sketch on the front plane and select a circle here so before that first we need to change the unit so here so again we'll just delete this get the delete this sketch here and now go to the sketch select the front plane and select a circle now it will be dimension in mm just provide the dimension so uh, let us add 3 mm and exit this workbench so go to the feature and make a extrude of a 20 mm just click okay so now we will make a head and the tail end of the screw so select this sketch on this face here and make this edge into converted into this so again go to the feature make this extrude and here just add 4 mm or maybe 3 mm only provide a draft here or outward draft and the angle will be 33 or you can define it as per your requirement okay so we are going to just create a simple model here so again we will make a slot here for torquing purpose so now create this as a center lines here for the reference purpose now select a center rectangle here and draw this rectangle on this face create another rectangle and provide the dimensions for this one so let us add 1.2 and this dimension as 5.2 so now just create some constraints over here just select this sketch and this sketch and make this as a equal similarly select this line and this line and make it as i uh, know not parallel actually so just delete this from here and make them equal now select this line this line and this line and make them as symmetric Similarly, select this line, this line, and this line, and make it again symmetric. So now use the trim option. So just select trim option, trim to closest. Just select these lines that we want to trim here. so now it is in a closed state and just exit this workbench now simply use extruded cut option and just provide a draft over here let us reduce this and add 
है टू एम एम एंड देन क्लिक ओके सो नाउ दिस स्लॉट इज क्रिएटेड सो दैट विल बी यूज फॉर दी टॉकिंग पर्पज सो नाउ विल क्रिएट अ टेल एंड ऑफ दिस स्क्रू सो अगेन सिलेक्ट द स्केच ऑन दिस फेस एंड मेक दिस एज अ कन्वर्टेड इंटीरियज एंड गो टू द एक्सट्रूड एंड अगेन प्रोवाइड ही आर सम डायमेंशंस लेट से एट एम एम एंड प्रोवाइड एंगल ही आर प्रोवाइड टू टेन टेन एम एम here 10 mm yeah so now it is the fine edge and now provide the fillet over here and then click okay so now uh, the fillet is created and now you can see here the screw body is created now we'll just create the threads over here so we'll create some planes here reference select the reference geometry select the plane and now to select the plane you can just maximize this tree here and select this front plane and just create a plane Keep this 18 as it is, and we'll create the plane here. And now, sketch on this plane. So, go to the normal view. Select again. So the orientation will get changed, and just convert this entity here. So this entity will be converted into this on this plane. and then just exit this workbench so now we will create the helix with respect to this circle and to create the helix go to the surfaces select the curves here so there are helix and spiral option available and select this circle you can see here uh, the helix is created we'll go to the constant speech let us add this speech as two here make this angle zero so go to this variable pitch again and select this as a 2 again this will be 2 you we'll just uh, increase this height here and we'll again keep this pitch as it is so uh, here again pitch keep this as it is and we'll add the revolution more than that so increase this one by one and for the diameter again uh, let us add 2.6 2.4 and 2 so go on increasing this one so 1.8 Just click OK. So now this uh, helix is created, and now select the top plane. That we will create the profile. 
go to the normal view just select a rectangle here you can create a profile make this equal and then click ok so now we'll just uh, try here um, sweeping so just select this swept lopped command and select this as this curve as a reference curve and then click ok So you can see here the just make this hide similarly make this hide and here so we can just increase this profile go to the top plane so just make this somewhat bigger so you can see here the threads is created so in this way you can create these uh, screws here in solidworks so we can provide some appearances here Just select any one of this and provide it to so already it is added here. Or maybe you can add some metal here, let's say polished steel. So you can see here the metal is applied. So thank you very much for watching and please like and subscribe my channel for more videos. Thank you.